second second skin is that what it was called second second skin let's try it I guess Ooh, so there's a red thing down there. There's a bunch of skulls. I can like shape this in some weird way. There's also skulls uh, in those two passages to the left and right with the laser going through them, so I can't go down there. Uh, I can't nudge them. But maybe I do want to reshape into another form rather than just drop things down. So, so effectively, eventually I want to... How many schools do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I think there are going to be two here, aren't there? Okay, I can kind of figure out what's going to go on down here. This is going to fall. A block is going to go to the right, it's going to keep going to the right and get destroyed, so no. Well basically I wanted to go to the left. Hit that, get pushed over and they both die on here. So do I want that one to not be used? Is that what I'm seeing here? Or will it get used just by only one block and another block comes down at some point? Hmm. The lock is opened there, and that is toggled here. Interesting. Oh, that might be another green man exit. Yeah, it totally is, I think. So what do I want to do here? I want to send one down, I guess. Let's not do it like that, let's do it like this. How do I send it down? Could I have pushed it? No. Because if I push it, I'm going to touch it and I'm going to stick back to it. I'm also not sure if I'm going to be making like weird shapes to stick down into these things. that one to drop one in the place where I want it. Yeah, sure, if I did, oop, if I did this and then that. Okay, I toggled the things. Can I do the same over here? I guess so, right? So I could do, I guess I want that to drop. Uh, I could do it like, uh, no, like this, and like that. But then it only opens for a second, so I want the thing to already be down there with the things already changed direction. So let's do it here. There's also the schools at the edge, which are very specific. They're, they're at the edge, so I have to use them in a certain way. So you're going to toggle that that way. I want another one to drop down that hole, so that's going to be on this side, okay. Sure. Then I want another one to go down there. It's getting more complicated now. Should I use those edge ones first? Okay, let's do that. Uh, so for the first one, let's go and use this. And this, nope, and this. Yeah, I see those two schools are set up. So the one I just used and the one below me right now are set up to allow me to use that thing on the left twice, which makes sense, I want to use it twice. So then I'm gonna use 
this one and this one. But now I'm in awkward shape. What are you two for? Does that help me somehow? To do that again, I'd have to have another another piece that's only connected by two, and those two are accessible to be destroyed. And it's at the bottom of the shape. I don't have that at all right now. Well, okay. <laughs> Another way of dropping one down these two places. Yes, it's really hard to do again. How many more do I need to drop? I need to drop that to open here, and I also need to drop one down there quickly, somehow. shouldn't use that one as well because I'm going to need it. Uh, sure, I could drop a two. Drop a two. And then that happens. I need to hit the other one quickly. Like, is it at all feasible that I could? I mean, it is. I'd have to leave that there though. So somehow I'd have to use you. I'm making a love heart, kind of. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Beautiful. Um, we already did the love heart level. That was much earlier on. This game is not about love anymore. turmoil and anguish 
not really. Uh, okay, so what I've learned is that I can do this, and I can do the other one. Can I have used these already? These two are annoying. What do they help me with? That. Oh, I guess I could do something like this, where I slide out the way. Oh. Oh. Okay. This could work then. And then, yeah, okay, then those two. Okay, we are done. I just have to slide out of the way, I have to do it twice, okay. Is this a timing thing? Can I do this? Yes, yes, I can. Ta-da! Okay, lovely. Whew. I'm not the worst at this game, it turns out. Well, maybe I am. <laughs> uh, that was 30. And I've already done 31, so 32 is next. Let's see how this goes. Oh, I looked at this one, didn't I? This looks complicated. Or well, at least it looks like there's some structure to it, though, as opposed to, like, is it the next one? That kind of looks... Oh, gosh, yeah. Let's do... Let's stick with Poke... Pokemon K2. Pokemon K2. My favourite Pokemon. Um, okay. That's there, that's there. This looks like the main event. <laughs> Trying to get to that red in the middle. Kinda. Although, can't I quite easily just like poke you in there? Yep. I can. Ow. So maybe that's not the main event. So I can also push you down there. There's a lock there. No, you're stuck. Oh. Okay. Yep. Oh gosh, this is gonna be another one that's even hard to read. Now what's with that shape up here? What's this space all about? And do I want to be doing this? There's no way for me to toggle the conveyor belt, so maybe... Yeah, yeah, in fact, yeah. That's 100% what's going to be happening, right? Unless I go up the other way and push it to the right. That's possible. Um, so what's my problem here? I guess there's also this one. How am I ever going to get you? By sticking a red thing in there. Right, okay, so what length red thing do I need to do that? Once you're against there, that's a bit annoying, isn't it? What would I need? One, two, three, four, five, six at least. But I'm not bringing that back out ever, so that's going to be the end, that's when the red ends. So I need to make a uh, a red stick that's going to go into here and that's going to disappear the reds. The blues look quite easy to do, right? I can just do the, the blues no problem. Yep. So obviously it's not that easy. I have to use the blues for something. So one problem I've got is how do I get the red back out of here once I've done that? Which is an interesting question. It's maybe the main question of this whole thing. Well, I guess, you know, if, if I stuck that in there, drop that out, if I could make some shape that I could like grab onto this red, although then I wouldn't be able to push it through there. I hope I could grab onto it from the other side. Can I somehow? I don't 
don't want to drop you to the bottom. What do I want to do? I want to somehow bring a red up, but to do that I'm going to have to use another red. Or push this red onto the blues, but then how do I do that while well, still be able to get underneath the blues? Maybe there would have been a way earlier. Uh, not like that. Ah, undid all the way to there. Can I stop the red? I can. Can I get around either side of the red? <laughs> I could go underneath it and push on there, okay. Now you come down. And go on top of this. Uh, sure. This feels like a weird one so far. Maybe because I'm doing completely the wrong things. But it also kind of feels okay. Like what I'm doing feels not like the worst thing ever. So now I can recover that. And that is not quite long enough. Okay, I see. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, I see what I'm doing. So, I need to stick those two on the end of it. So then it's a case of how do I get these out? I don't think I'm going up, am I? This is going this way. But I probably don't want to be in here. Oh, but I can't help that. Like, is there ever any chance of me pushing that from the left? But why is that space there on the left? Is there ever some way that could work? Like, I couldn't do it by prodding it through. That's not going to work. I need to use the blue to help me. This blue shape is very convenient. Well, I guess I could just pull you this way. That's true. What about the other one? Could I now... Definitely feel like I'm just fudging my way through this. Oh. I can now hold you open. Okay. But this is going to be a problem. Now only attached to that certain way. That feels so specifically. Sh uh, I don't know. Is that's not so specifically distanced? If it was, it'd be one further over. Oh, well, I could just leave you there and put you down here. Okay, am I fudging my way through this? Is this the right solution? Because I think I'm done? Uh, or am I? Can I not get that through? No, I can't get that through, can I? There's not enough space. In which case, maybe I didn't want to attach one of the things, because like I just noticed, I could have pressed that lock with one less, and I still be able to get through the gap. Okay, but the last one I did was that one in there. Uh, okay, but I could... Oh, let me think about this. Last one I did was the one that was in there. I think it might be pretty close. Okay. 
And in theory, I could just send that down still. Right? And perhaps use that. Oh, but then I get stuck in there. That's the problem with that. Unless there's a way of avoiding me getting stuck in there. I can't prod it through. And I can't make the red stick any longer. Okay, we're not gonna have another problem. If I push this down, uh, don't go that way. Oh. <laughs> I bring it down. I mean, I can just bring it over here. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, okay. So how do I do this? I can't push it with the blues. I can't do that. Oh, I mean, I totally can do that, because I can just go alongside that. Oh. Oh, but I can't stick those that way around. Do I first want to go in and nudge the other one over? Is that what this is saying to me? So don't push that down yet. Push this here, which is exactly the right distance. Go in, push this one over. Yeah, I'm doing that method of solving where it's like, just correct the previous thing. How did I do this a second ago? Uh, oh yeah, that's gonna stay open. That's fine. Oh, but now I can't chase it down. Oh, but I can just leave again. Uh, but I need to push you down onto the blue thing, which I can't because you're holding that up. But I can because you can do that. I'm just like, I'm going like one extra step, finding a problem, fixing that problem. I think we're done. Because this is now uh, not too wide. You can go uh, kind of almost. Um, <laughs> I could just push you to the side. There we go. Yes. Yes. Duh. Yay! <laughs> Definitely a weird one. Oh look, there's a flag. Oh, and I've reached the 75% marker where the flag is. That makes some sense, I guess. But what happens after the flag? Oh, I see. So getting to 75% just means that the, maybe this is the end of the game. Check and flag. Oh gosh, yeah, maybe that's meant to be like the final level. So all that 75% does is reveal that level. But I've still got all these other levels to do. Uh, starting with 33. I'm, I'm doing pretty well now, actually. I'm getting a couple done um, each time, which is not terrible. I guess I just needed to get past cr Crocodile. Because I didn't have too much trouble with reflection in the end. This is my first attempt at it wasn't the best, but ultimately I found that okay. Crocodile was a strange one. Um, and then the two I just did, whatever they were, I had a good time with. Uh, the second one was strange simply because of the whole... I didn't quite know what I was trying to do the whole time. I was just doing it step by step and eventually ended up with the right thing. It was fun. I still liked it. Um, okay, 33 is next. Let's see what's happening there.